Well, you can expect if you have nasal polyposis that the sinus surgery will improve significantly your symptoms. Um, another reason to perform the surgery is to open up the sinuses uh, as much as possible and remove all the polyps um, so that medical treatment and local treatment can uh, have good access to the sinuses. Well, we routinely do not perform CT scans to assess how large the polyps are. The um, diagnosis is mainly based upon nasal endoscopy and uh, the symptoms of the patients. However, when you plan a surgery, it's uh, of the most importance to have a CT scan. First of all, to know the anatomy, to do the surgery in a safe way, but also to see what's the extension of the nasal polyposis, um, to do the surgery completely to remove all the polyps. You inform your patients well about what he can expect from a sinus surgery, um, that this is an essential part in his treatment, but um, that is only a step in the treatment so that he has to continue postoperatively with medical treatment. We routinely don't give any oral corticosteroids before surgery as they, this can uh, affect also the healing after the surgery. Um, but when there is significant uh, infection, we give culture-directed antibiotics preoperatively. Patients are informed that they have to uh, rinse their nose four to five times a day, use ointment and also use a local corticosteroid spray. And also, once the healing phase has been done, he has to continue with washings and uh, local corticosteroids to maintain the result of the surgery and control the disease.